My name is Rick Armstead and I'm going to be performing a task in uh, ear bandage. This is Bentley and she's my patient. I have all my necessary uh, tools here. I have gauze, um, cast bandage, gauze wrap, and vet wrap. We'll start with the gauze. Put one gauze on each side of the ear. And put it on top of her head. And I'll take my cast bandage and start the top and roll it around in front of the ear and then all the way back and come on the other side of the ear. I just made sure I, I didn't get too close to the eye and I didn't make it too tight around her throat. So now with the gauze wrap, I'll just continue the same direction, do the same thing. I'll take some bandage scissors and just cut that right there. And finish with my vet wrap. Start going the same direction. Do the same thing. And I'd already unrolled this vet wrap and re-rolled it so it's nice and loose. I don't have to worry about it being too tight around her throat. The last thing I'll do is I'll put this piece of tape right here on this tab. It's got my initials on it and the date so we know when we need to rewrap this ear or take it off. Um, another thing you can do is take a sharpie and outline the ear to make sure if whoever's taking this bandage off, if they're using scissors, they don't cut the ear. So now I'll take the bandage off. Just do everything I did backwards. So I got the vet wrap off, now I'll just uh, unroll the, the gauze wrap the same way. So I got the uh, bandage wrap off, now I'll just do the same thing with the cast bandage. So the last thing I'll do is I'll just take the golf sponge off the ear and let it go. And that's how you apply an ear bandage and remove an ear bandage.